your gentlemen show pleasure winner tonight it's El Zorro star Kenny Compton makes the good ride for Rick Compton of North Tazewell Virginia Kenny Compton and El Zorro star So it's back-to-back -back World Grand Championship titles for I'm Copperfield. Kenny Compton makes the winning ride. Rick Compton is the owner from North Tazewell, Virginia, retiring all the challenge trophies and claiming the 2013 and 2014 titles. I'm Copperfield. They have the approval of all five judges. Now give them yours as they leave the ring tonight. Kenny Compton makes the winning ride for Rick Compton of North Tazewell, Virginia. Kenny Compton and I'm Copperfield. How about sending them out with a big round of applause? of the judging panel, that's Geronimo. Janice Fosting making the triple blue ribbon ride. She's from Roanoke, Virginia. Give her a spring jubilee round of applause. Geronimo and Janice Fosting, let's take a look and give Janice a nice round of applause. She makes the show ring a blue ribbon winner at Wood Mary, 2019 81st Angel Show in the class for the amateur riders on the three-year-old horses. Now here comes our champion down the west side. Let's give him a champion's applause. Jose, it ain't so. That's Jonathan Watts riding the entry on by Deborah Williams of Argyle, Texas. Now is the three-year-old world grand champion, Tennessee Walking Horse, 2012. First and all three judges cards, our amateur canter winner is Jose. So in the state of Kentucky, Lester H. Burns is many things, but in Shelbyville, Tennessee, Lester H. Burns is a world grand champion. And that's Ryan Blackford, who makes his very first World Grand Championship ride tonight. Martin Cox is the owner from Corbin, Kentucky. Lester H. Burns and Ryan Blackburn. Ladies and gentlemen, make this a memorable victory pass for them tonight. Let them hear from you as they leave the ring. Martin Cox riding Lester H. 
Under the spotlight here on Friday night for owner Joe Fostek of Roanoke, Virginia. The final ride here on Friday night belongs to our four year old world grand champion, and for 2016, that title belongs to Marty McFly. Casey Wright makes the championship ride tonight aboard the entry owned by Joe Fostek of Roanoke, Virginia. Casey Wright and Marty McFly. Ah, uh, championship four to close out on Friday night with a four-year-old title. find their number at the top of all three judges cards tonight. The unanimous choice for our three-year-old classic blue ribbon. Here's Omaha. Scott Beatty makes the winning ride and campaigns the entry for Joe Barnes of Pigeon Forge. Scott Beatty and Omaha with a trainer show blue ribbon ride in our three-year-old classic tonight. Uh, Shane Shiflett catches that winning moment for Omaha. One six. Now let's take a look at our blue ribbon winner putting cash on the line. Molly Walsh is riding. Molly Walsh is family into Roger on the line, California. Give Molly a nice round of applause as she leaves the show ring. The 15 to an under walking mares have been called and will be coming. Our trainers, family members, and auxiliary class putting cash on the line and Taylor Walters.
coaches are in agreement. It's a unanimous World Grand Championship win for Dobie Gray and Sarah Coffey Burks. The owner and rider from Calhoun, Georgia, they wear the roses in the tricolors tonight. Dobie Gray and Sarah Coffey Burks, our owner amateur three-year-old World Grand Champion. Uh, walking right out of the roses tonight, but walking down victory lane, congratulations. Find the number 352 at the top of all three judges' cards tonight. That number belongs to the Who. Taylor Walters makes the Blue Ribbon Ride for owner Kelsey Andrews of Rancho Mirage, California. Taylor Walters and the Who are amateur five and over Blue Ribbon winners. 